Hey, my name is Ian Hildebrand, and this is my Jesus story. When I was born, I was diagnosed with alopecia universalis, which means I cannot grow hair anywhere on my body. It wasn't easy growing up with alopecia universalis. You know, growing through elementary and middle school, it was, it was a tough time trying to meet new people. Kids would always stare or they would they would call me names, you know, I would, I was, I grew up ridiculed and um, they would always exclude me from anything. So I grew to be um, pretty shy. Um, I struggled to make any friends outside of church. So I tried to hide. I would put a hat on or anything like that, a hood or anything I could hide behind. And I would stay away from any kind of social interaction with anybody. So, uh, Fine arts has always been a big thing in my family. We always believe that it's a, it's a uh, tool God gave us to uh, develop talents that He blesses with um, to share His gospel. And uh, growing up, I was always able to choose which one I wanted to do. Uh, so I've always done like a picture or art or something easy that I could not, you know, show my face behind. Um, and so my dad came up to me when I was in eighth grade and he said, uh, Ian, you're, you ready for fine arts? And I said, um, yeah, I got a picture picked out. And he told me, he's like, no. Um, I was like, what do you mean no? And he's like, you're gonna be doing more than just a picture this year. I said, what do you mean? He's like, you're gonna do a short sermon along with the picture. And that terrified me, I did not wanna do that. Uh, I was so shy and I said no. And uh, I fought him on it, but then I finally gave in because he's my dad. Um, and I, I, I didn't want to do it, so I didn't put my 100% into it. Uh, so when it came along to a couple weeks before Fine Arts, we were um, at Sunday service and they were doing worship. And so God spoke to me in worship and He said, Ian, why are you, why are you hiding? He said, you are beautiful the way you are. I made you this way for, for a purpose and you were meant to reach out and help other people like you. And he said, no longer f walk in fear because you can have confidence in me. And that night I took off the hat and I said, you know what God, um, if you said I can have your confidence, I'll trust you and I'll try it out. After the fact that I chose to walk in confidence with God, um, you know, it doesn't change the fact that people are gonna make fun of me that people are gonna look at me differently. Um, but I have been able to make a lot more relationships that actually are meaningful, and I feel they're gonna be lifelong relationships, or at least um, they're gonna affect how I'm gonna live my life. Uh, I have developed a lot of relationships uh, moving here to Crown Point. You know, there's lots of people that really stuck out and came up to me and talked to me, and we have tight relationships like that. And at school, I still struggle with bullies, but you know, I, I can get beyond that and I have been able to make friends and um, that kind of stuff. I would say that God made you that way. It wasn't a mistake. He has plans for the way he made you. Um, there's ways that you will be able to affect others that nobody else can. Um, it's a tool, it's not a curse. My name is Ian Hildebrand, and this is my Jesus story.